Hello, Peter Baker here. If you're a fellow voiceover and you've got a broadcast quality studio like myself, you know what it's like when you're away for a few days, maybe on holiday or on a business trip, staying in a hotel, you get the phone call, an urgent voiceover needed straight away. No time or maybe no money to book a studio near where you are. So what do you do? You've got your microphone with you, but that's no good, is it? Because you're in an echoey hotel room. Uh, maybe there's noises outside. You can try and put blankets over your head that's no good. Let me give you a couple of really good, solid, practical alternatives that I've tried out and can recommend to you. First of all, if it's a very, very quiet room, then the Chaotica eyeball is excellent. Canadian invention, big bit of foam, very solid foam, and very carefully hollowed out. So you put your microphone inside it. This is a double pop filter that goes on the front of it. It is good, but it only kind of works in a very quiet situation. Basically, what the Chaotica eyeball does is to uh, stop the reflections on the wall. Um, so it won't stop too much inherent noise if there's a party going on next door or even traffic outside. That's the problem. So what can you do? Well, the thing you can do is go to Ikea. It's a Swedish store. You may have one in, uh, in your country, wherever you're watching it from. This is a flat pack thing. It's called a Drona. It's only £2.50. It's basically used as a waste bin, I think, or for putting papers in or something. You could use any cardboard box, but the Drona basically just pops up, you zip the back, and it becomes a box. And in there, and I've got one completed here, is what I finished earlier is uh, one with all the bits inside it. Now you see we have here the acoustic foam panels, which you can get from eBay or Amazon or anywhere. It just so happens that this make of foam acoustic panels are 33 centimeters wide, just the same width as the Drona box, which is a coincidence. So you just shove it in, you cut the bit for the top, put that in as well. And the lower level here, if you can just see up there, is another bit of foam but a flatter piece of foam because you're going to put your microphone on there and it doesn't have to be so bubbly or acoustic. And there's something else that goes in there as well. You see, can you guess what it is yet? Oh, you see, there are quite a few of these things around. You've probably seen those parabolic reflector things and they're great for singers because they've got all the, the lyrics in their head. Us voiceovers, we're stupid. We need a script. So how do you read a script if you've got one of those parabolic things in front of you, eh? And how am I going to cope if I've got a box in front of me as well? Well, that's where this monitor comes in. You'll see the monitor there at the back of the box, and that's simply connected to the laptop that's outside. Yes, you could put your little laptop inside the box, but then you get uh, a rather warm laptop that will probably blow up in front of your face. Uh, or, of course, you get the fan noise, which you don't want at all. So the perfect solution is to put a little USB monitor, that's a Lilliput USB monitor, at the back of your box. And then you simply get it at the right height, talk into your box. And uh, honestly, it, it is very, very good quality indeed. In fact, if you have a really bad, bad hotel room with a, a wild party going on next door, uh, then you can have the Chaotica eyeball as well as the box. Now, the main issue with both these solutions is that they do increase the bass response. So you do have to add in a little bit of EQ when you're mixing down your tracks before you send them off to the client. And you need to determine that at base and not in the hotel room because on headphones you just can't tell properly. So do it at base when you've got your big studio speakers in front of you. Save it as a preset in Adobe Audition or whatever you're using up there and then apply that once you've recorded using either the box or the box and the Chaotica eyeball, which you may need if you're in a very, very noisy uh, situation. So I hope that's of use to you and good luck recording in your hotel room.